Hi, and welcome to the Photoshop Shop. Today we're going to show you how to use the clone stamp to do basic retouching. The first thing I do is always make a copy of my image. So I'll hit Command J, and then I'm going to go ahead and hide my original. So I'm going to work from my copy. Select your clone stamp, then select the size of brush you'd like to use. I'm going to use a fairly small brush, 15 pixels, and I'm going to have my hardness all the way down. I'll keep the mode normal the opacity and flow at 100% and I'm in a sample from my current layer so go ahead and zoom in and what you're going to do is press down the Option key if you're using a Mac or the Alt key if you're using Windows. Click your mouse and what that will do is sample the area from where you clicked. So down here we'll go ahead and select this and click and cover that and we'll click here and cover that and we'll click here and cover that. We can click here, cover that. Now say we want to take out this blade of grass. We'll go ahead and zoom in and we'll select here and get the same tones. And we will just run this right along. Right along next to it. So we're getting the same color tones and shading as we get closer to the grass. And we want to take this out. And now for right here, we want to just bring that over. We want to bring this down. And then we want to shade this in. If you get to a point where you see that the shading is has a harsh line, go up to Opacity. Put that at about 47, 50%. Come back down. Take this shading and just blend it in a little bit. We'll extend that up a little bit more to blend that in a little bit more favorably. And there you go, we've removed the blade of grass. Just wanted to show you how easy it is to use the clone stamp to do a little simple retouching on the face, as well as removing small objects from in front of your subject. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time at the Photoshop Shop.